I'm George Hodgson, founder of Maze on the Tube. Maze on the Tube was started out of my severe mental health. After a period of crippling anxiety and OCD, I, I was using all my drawings. I used to write down my, all my thoughts and feelings in little black notebooks. Um, and I used all my thoughts and feelings and put them on Photoshop and started playing around with them. And I thought, if I can put these on a t-shirt, portray what I was going through and express what I was going through, then other people will know what I'm going through. So I started by putting them on t-shirts and it's sort of grown from that really and it's become a really positive message and a really strong brand, spreading awareness um, and raising funds for mental health. Maison D is obviously household in French. Chute was a nickname for my sister Charlotte when I was younger um, and she sort of helped me when I was suffering and is always there for me. So it's like a dedication to her essentially, it's House of Charlotte. All the, the, the t-shirts and the hoodies and the jumpers, they're all made from 100% organic ethically sourced cotton um, and made ethically with like, organic dyes and we also send out our products when we send them in the post in brown paper bags, panic attack bags to be precise because I used to use panic attack bags when I was suffering and we send them out in these panic bags which are recyclable and you can just throw them away. So everything we do is sort of ethical and sustainable and can be obviously thrown away or reworn. The Maze on the Tube target market is quite broad because we all know someone that suffers from mental health. So you have the young students that really love the brand, think it's edgy and cool and they love wearing it, um, but they sometimes struggle to pay for it. So you've got the parents of those people who buy the products and then you've got the parents that have children that suffer that also buy the products because they know someone that suffers. So there's always someone buying uh, the product because they know someone that suffers and it reaches quite a wide audience. So with the Worry Not Worry patches, we wanted to create something small um, that people could put on a denim jacket or their trousers or something that wasn't so bold because a lot of our designs are quite bold. Um, so we wanted something quite small quite uh, nimble that could go on a piece of clothing but could still represent the brand. I partnered with the Young Minds charity um, when we launched with the Words Fail Me t-shirt and I wanted to give back to a charity that helped young people specifically because um, I was a young person suffering but I was fortunate enough to get private mental health help but a lot of young people aren't in the same position so can't do that. So I wanted to give back to a charity that helps young people in the less fortunate position and we donate 25% of proceeds to them from certain designs. So the future is quite exciting because we're working on loads of new designs and we've got loads of new concepts and lots of collaborations coming up. We're about to release a new collaboration um, of a t-shirt that says sometimes I'm okay, sometimes I'm not, um, which has been hand embroidered and it looks beautiful. And we're going to tell everyone's story from that hand embroidery. Um, and just working on new designs, new products and keep pushing for mental health to be changed, you know, spreading awareness and continuing to raise funds with your minds. And we also now partner with a new charity as well called the Shaw Mind Foundation. So we're now with two charities as well, which is great. The market is changing and people are moving away from high street brands because who wants to look like 6,000 other people on the street? And people like buying things that have a story, have meaning behind them and that they can tell that story and that they feel they have something special because it means a lot more um, if you have something that has a meaning behind it. They also like buying things that have longevity um, that you can wear again and again and again. It's timeless and it doesn't wear out and you don't have to keep replacing it. It's not fast fashion and it's not throwaway fashion.